Susan Blow was born in 1843, and she was the oldest of six children. She was the daughter of Henry Taylor Blow and Minerva Grimsley Blow. Uh, her hometown was St. Louis, Louis, Missouri, and she was born June 7th of 1843. Her middle name is Elizabeth, and she came from a wealthy family who worked in the lead industry. Uh, her father was a leader in the St. Louis business and Missouri politics. Uh, at the age of six, there was a house fire, and it actually burned down most of the town of St. Louis. So she had to move to Carondelet, and they also moved there because of a cholera epidemic, and their fa father wanted them away from it. Um, by the age of 16, she attended two private schools, uh, one in New Orleans, Louisiana, and one in New York City. Uh, her family was pro-union and anti-slavery. Um, her private school in New York City closed shortly after attending due to the Civil War. Um, she observed classrooms in Germany for five years after the Civil War had ended. And these classrooms were inspired by Friedrich Froebel. Um, and as she observed these classrooms she wanted children in America to learn by play using blocks and different balls different shapes stuff like that um she opened the first public kindergarten at Des Marais school in Carondelet uh this was the first of it of its kind it was a very colorful classroom and it had child size tables chairs and other things that are more kid oriented that wasn't the social norm at the time um, it was very colorful and inviting, unlike all the previous classrooms. Um, her kindergarten also taught about eating well, exercise, and how to keep clean. She retired in 1884 due to getting sick, and she moved to New York City. Her legacy, uh, her, her first classroom became a model for all future kindergartens, and they are still used today. Um, by 1879, 53 kindergarten rooms were in St. Louis, Missouri. Uh, she wrote many books, uh, one about Dante and um, others about the work of Fribel. And after she was done being kindergarten director, she, she wrote those books and she did a tour around America about her kindergarten movement. Uh, she gave lectures until her death which was March 26 of 1916. Um, some interesting facts. Um, Blow grew up, grew from 60, from 68 children to 9,000 children in just 11 years as a kindergarten director. Um, in 1875, um, her kindergarten was attempted to be shut down, but 1,500 signatures petitioned the decision to save it. Um, Within one year, 150 women volunteered to be assistants in her kindergarten classrooms. Um, she was diagnosed with Graves' disease in 1884. Um, that is when she, she moved and retired as being a kindergarten director. Um, she wrote a total of five books on Fribble series and then one book on Dante. She also helped to find the International Kindergarten Union. Um, she had no formal high school education, um, but was given a three-year appointment to Teachers College, Teachers College of Columbia University, but I don't believe she ever attended. Um, closer to her older years, she moved to Casanova, New York. Uh, she never married, um, but she continued. She was all about her education and finding these kindergartens. She brought them over from Germany and wanted them in America um, to help better educate the the children. And that is my project on Susan Blau, who was. Um, born in 1843 and died in 1916.